This is my V2 3D printed rocket. It's printed in three parts. So you got the nose pin here. And then you have a midsection, which is right here. And then the tail section is right here. So there's only three parts. And all three parts assemble together. Like this. And then the motor. This is a um, H130 motor, but I can put in an I motor as well into here. So it's a 38 millimeter uh, diameter. Two, this is a two grain motor and I can put a three grain motor in here. So the motor actually goes in here and it screws in like so. And it has an insulation black disc here, which is made out of a high temperature melting point plastic, which is, which is polycarbonate that I 3D printed that ring. So that insulation ring holds it in place. And as this screws in, it, it holds on the body. So the body, two body parts won't, won't come apart. So this, the motor mount also holds the rocket together. And then the nose of course, still comes out. Now the nose cone has one of my electronic eBay cartridges in, in it. So the, you've seen these before in some of my past videos. Uh, the eBay cartridge unscrews. And so inside, in this case, you have the altimeter and the lithium polymer battery. I have other versions. For example, this one here is, um, has a, a telemetry transmitter and a GPS plus the altimeter all on this one board and the antenna here and then the lithium polymer battery on the back. So that can also go in here and screw in here and so forth. So depending on what I want to do, I can fly it with or without the uh, tracking telemetry transmitter. This, out, this rocket's going to be a pretty low altitude rocket, so I'll probably just fly it with just the altimeter. And of course, the uh, eye bolt is incorporated in this module, this cartridge, that I can plug in like that. Okay. And so we saw the, um, the motor, how it screws and unscrews. And just for kicks, I printed a white nose cone, so for a different look. So I could have a white nose cone on it or put the camouflage nose cone. This camouflage coloring is actually scale because there were a, a few models that uh, were actually painted in this color here. And uh, so I think I said this is a 1 18th scale. That's 1 over 18, which means that uh, the, the V2 rocket was about 14 meters uh, long. And this one here is 40 centimeters tall. So that ratio is 1 to 18. So the reason why I printed it this size is because I can easily fit it on my 3D printer. This tail section, which is from here to here, is as bit as tall in the z-axis as I can print and so that's why I came about and this here is actually I could have printed all this one part but I wanted to have this uh, disconnect in the middle so I actually printed it in two parts originally I uh, was gonna have the whole rocket only two parts but I ended up going with three parts that's it